Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you guys how I achieved this makeup look that Jennifer Lopez was wearing the other night on the red carpet. She had this gorgeous coral kind of uh, peachy eye and then a kind of Barbie lip. So if you guys want to see how I got this look, then please stay tuned. So first off, I am taking a wet beauty blender and my Amazonian Tarte Clay Foundation in the color Medium Sand and just applying that all over my face. Alright, step two, I am taking my True Match Concealer and just putting that underneath my eyes. Now I'm just blending this out with my ring finger. And going in with my beauty blender. Next, I'm taking my Anastasia Contour Kit and I'm grabbing the color Banana. And just setting underneath. Next, I am taking an angled brush and using my Anastasia Contour Kit again. And I am using the brown shade in the middle, the taupe looking shade. And just going to be putting that in the hollows of my cheeks, my temple, and down my jawline. I'm just doing a three. This large all over brush and using the same color by Real Techniques and just going down the sides of my nose just to give it some nice definition. Now I am just taking my large powder brush and taking the browner shade, swirling that in and just giving myself an all over bronzer to evenly blend this out a little bit. All right. Next, I am going to move on to the eyes and I'm grabbing the Lorac Behind the Scenes Eye Primer. I'm putting that all over my lid. So next off, I am taking my Lorac Unzipped Blush Palette and using the color Unrated and Unimaginable and just putting those on my blush brush. Now I'm just going to sweep that over my eyelid. Now that we've created a nice corally base, pretty pink base. I'm taking the Maybelline Master Glaze Studio Face Studio Blush Stick in Coral Sheen number 30. Grabbing that on my finger. I'm just dabbing that in my crease and down to my tear. I'm using a patting motion to evenly distribute the color. So I don't want to clump it up by going back and forth with it and dragging it over the eyelid. Next, I am taking this little Techniques brush, accent brush, and grabbing a little more of this color. And just going to 
bring it underneath my eye. Again, dabbing it on because we want this to have a nice, subtle, soft look. Not harsh lines, which is why I'm not using an eyeliner brush. A lay down brush and grabbing the color Unpredictable. And I am just adding that all over my eyelid. Now, grabbing a tiny bit of Undeniable, just ever so slightly, and a tiny bit of Unpredictable on a blending brush. And now I'm just going to lightly blend this over the top. Next, I am taking the Essence Metal Glam Eyeshadow and grabbing that on the same blending brush and adding that over the top and blending I'm just going to grab a little more of this coral color on my finger and dab that back in and slightly over the top. Next, on another blending brush, I am just grabbing the color Unlocked and putting that underneath my brow bone and up top here. And now I'm just going to blend this all in. Next, grabbing my Maybelline Eye Studio and a eyeliner brush. Just doing the eyeliner along the lash line and not any further because she's not wearing a cat eye or anything like that. So just along the lash line because we are going to be adding false lashes and you don't want those visible. Now I'm grabbing my eyelash curler. Next, grabbing my CoverGirl Bombshell Volume number one. which is a stiffer bristle, plastic ones, kind of like the They're Real by Benefit brush. And this will just separate the lashes. Now I'm grabbing the second one, which is for volumizing. And I'm just going to use that on the top lashes because I want the bottom ones not to be clumpy looking but I want the top to be nice and volumized like she has her lashes. Next I'm grabbing my Ardell Falsies in Black 110. These are my favorite. Next, I am grabbing my Anastasia pencil and just going along the bottom just to add a tiny bit of definition. 
but her eyebrows are very natural looking so I'm not going to do the top I just wanted to define them a tiny bit give a nice line right along those but still keeping natural Now I'm going to curl my lashes together so we don't have two sets of lashes hanging out. Taking this black eyeliner pencil and just lining my upper waterline. Yes, next I'm grabbing the Anastasia Contour Kit. And I'm grabbing the shimmery highlighter color. I'm just putting that along the tops of my cheeks. <clears throat> All right, for the last step, I am just grabbing London Butter London's Lippy in the color Alco Pop and putting that on. And that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe and have an awesome day.